week and uh, you know get out there and uh, hopefully finish with 11 wins. How long did it take you to get over the stun of the Ohio State game? I mean, it took a little minute, but I mean, I, w I was good. You know, you got to get over it and move forward. You know, I felt like the strength coaches uh, did a great job last week with that. You know, uh, talked to us about it uh, during the week last week while we had our lifts. And I feel like our team's in a, a pretty good spot right now mentally. So uh, our goal right now is to beat Florida. What did they say? You said they talked to you. What I mean, just say? just told us, you know, like we got to move on. You know, it, it happened and you know, we can't dwell on it and can't keep it with us because if we do, then, you know, we're not going to have a good outcome in our, in our next game. What were the defensive players? I mean, what was their reaction in the week or so following that? Because it I caught mean, you guys by surprise. Yeah, I mean, we, we didn't watch the film as a team, but I mean, everybody was pretty bummed out. You know, uh, we felt like we could have played better as a, as a team, as a defense. Um, I mean, but right, right now we just got to move forward. So, How fixable are some of those mistakes that you guys made or ways that they were able to catch you? How much do you think you'll be able to... I mean, I feel like we got a, a good chance to, you know, change that, change that around. You know, that only happened to us once this year, and I feel like we're, that's not who we are. I feel like we are, we're going to come into this matchup, the, the defense that we've been playing like all year. So uh, we got about a good month to, you know, get ready. How much more zone did you play against Ohio State than you had all year? I mean, I feel like we, played, we played a lot of zone. We played a lot of man as well. Um, I'm not really sure how many, how many zone calls were called or man calls were called. Did you have a message to the team to, as the captain afterwards at all? Uh, no, nobody really got to talk to talk to the team really afterwards besides Coach Harbaugh talked to us. Uh, uh, yeah, I talked to the safety group a little bit because we were in a group chat, but uh, not, not really no one has really spoke up to the team yet. We haven't been together as a full team for a practice yet. Did their speed surprise you at all? Uh, they got a couple fast guys, but I feel like we played against fast guys all year, so I mean... Um, you know, they, they did uh, challenge us with speed, you know, especially 21. He got on the edge a couple of times. But other than that, I didn't feel like we, that we, they didn't have speed that we'd never seen before. How much Florida have you watched? I haven't watched any yet. I mean, I just watched like a couple games like throughout the year, but I haven't broke down their film yet or started yet. Does it feel to, to play them third time in your in four years here? I mean, uh, it's, it's a great university, good opponent to go against. Uh, so, I mean, it's an exciting game. Um, you know, I'm ready to get after against them. Would you ever thought when you first came to Michigan that you would be playing Florida three? No, nah, I did not. Uh, it would probably be like a one-time thing. So, uh, now this is our third time. We just got to, you know, rise to the opportunity and, and play well and get the 11th win. There's a narrative out there now that you guys will never be competitive with Ohio State on a regular basis again. How do you respond to that? I mean, I, I don't think that's true. I mean, they, they had our number for a lot of years, but, I mean, you know, I feel like we're getting better um, as a team. I feel like this team is going to be a lot better next year as well, and, and it's going to be able to compete uh, really well in that game next year. So um, that narrative, it, it won't end. It won't. It won't be that long. Why do you think this team will be better next year? Uh, just, just I'm excited. You know, for the guys that are coming back. Uh, you know, especially on the offense. Uh, everyone's pretty much coming back besides Karan, and uh, you know they they show so much. Uh, so much greatness this year at times and, and showed that they could click in all cylinders. And, uh, you know, with the defense, a lot of a lot of guys coming back as well. So, I mean, I'm excited for this team as well for next year. How was young safeties progressing? Good. Uh, Brad Hawkins, Jamar Woods, and Jalen Kelly Powell, they're all doing really good. Um, you know, they'll have a lot of opportunity to play in these last, these last two to three weeks while we get ready for the, the bowl game. Uh, so, I'm excited for them as well. They've been playing really well. How about the young players? Good. They've, they've all been playing good as well, too. So 